Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Assalamu Alaikum In today's video we are going to learn about temporary accounts We will see today the definition of temporary accounts list of temporary accounts the general entries to close the temporary accounts and the income summary account So first of all we need to know what are the temporary accounts Temporary accounts are those general ledger accounts which has a zero balance at starting of each accounting period these are also called the nominal accounts or the operational accounts of a company these are the accounts which are deciding the net profit or loss of the business so let's see further the list the first one are the sales account what are the sales and contra sales accounts are involved these are our revenues or the total sales gain or sales interest income or contra account as suppose sales discounts and sales returns so temporary accounts these accounts we need to close them we are closing these accounts at each accounting period with income summary account we are transferring their ending balance to the income summary account so the first entry we will pass to close the sales account it is sales account debit and income summary account will be credit same when we are dealing with the sales discount account or sales return account we are making income summary account debit and sales discount or sales return account credit the second accounts are expense accounts the expense accounts are involved cost of goods sold advertising expense operational or operating expenses amortization expense insurance expense rent expense salaries and wages utilities marketing and so on so to close these expense account we need to pass the following entry which is income summary account debit and expense account credit as we are closing all the expense account to income summary account to know the net profit or loss of the business so these income uh, sales and expense account they are deciding either the company is making profit or loss so these are temporary accounts nominal or the operational account of a business the third one which is the owner drawings account this account is not involved to decide whether the business is making profit or loss but this account is also a temporary account this account is related to the capital account of the business so what entry we are going to pass to close this account at the end of accounting period is capital account debit and drawings account credit these are the withdrawal uh, of the owner for his personal use so closing owner drawings account to capital account this is also a temporary account closing the fourth account which we are going to close or a temporary account is income summary account the first one uh, i would like to explain you that the sales account and the expense account these both accounts are going to transfer to income summary account to decide whether there is a profit or loss if we have a profit then income summary account will be debit and retained earning account will be credit if we are facing loss then this entry will be reversed so retained earning account will debit and income summary account will credit in case of loss so keep in mind we are going to close also our income summary account let me show you now the format of income summary account as you can see here income summary account we have closed our sales or revenue to our income summary account as credit and here cost of goods sold expense admin expense financial or selling expenses we have closed here in income summary account as debit so after we have a profit so when we have a profit suppose this is 500 as a sales and we have 400 total for the expenses so we have 100 profit so this profit goes to the retained earning account so the retained earning account is a balance sheet account as a permanent account which will keep showing on balance sheet now let's summarize what i have learned today 
so the first entry what we are doing closing or transferring revenue or sales account to income summary account here as i have done here second closing or transferring expense accounts to income summary account as we have done here as you can see 400 then closing or transferring income summary account to owner's equity account or retained earning account owner equity account when there is a sole proprietorship there will be an owner equity account which will keep increasing or decreasing by net profit or net loss so income summary account will be closed by retained earning account or owner's equity account at the end i have told you that closing directly a drawings account to the capital account of the owner because these are the spending of the owner for his personal use here I have mentioned here in this ledger that owner's capital account debit and owner's drawings account credit. Usually owner's drawings are always debit but when we are closing that account we are going to make it zero for the coming year so we have to make it credit. So guys this is the concept of temporary account and I hope you like my today's video please subscribe my channel so I will be keep motivated to create more videos for you. Thank you very much. Good luck and goodbye.